So, hello guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Emily Peter. If you are new here, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, I love you guys and I appreciate you. So, guys, on today's video, it's very interesting. I mean, <laughs> guys, I guess what I'm about to show you, most of you have never experienced it. Yes. So, it's about crawling. So when I give birth to my child, you know, there are several processes that a child has to take. And one of these is crawling. So guys, when my child reached that, that age, you know, those months, when she started to crawl, she was not crawling. As in, she was very heavy, you know, big. So I used to wonder, will my child ever get to walk? You know, before you know, before a child can walk, she has to crawl. Eh, someone gonna own to to wangu ni no no, as in she she was heavy. So I thought maybe she could not support her weight with her legs. So one time, you know, I had I used to go do my errands and then come back later in the evening. So I used to ask her nanny, has the child crawled yet? She's like, no. Then I really used to have a lot of stress, you know. As a first time mom, I was thinking maybe she's not okay, you know. She has a problem. Maybe she needs help. So every time I went, when I came back, I would ask her, has she crawled yet? No. Until one time. So this time, I asked her, has she crawled yet? And she was like, where I left her, I did not find her there. You know, you have to put a child down in the toy so that she can play. But now, where she left the child, she did not find her there. So I wondered, eh? And how did she crawl? She was like, I did not see, but I did not leave her there. Okay, that day passed. Another day came. I asked her. She was like, I, I also, where I also left her, I did not find her there. So I was like, how is she crawling? But I was like, oh, okay, maybe she's crawling, but when no one is around. So there's this time I went. When I also came back, hey, I asked her, and she told me that she's crawling with her bags, you know, with her bum bum. <laughs> then so I was like, huh? is that normal? Because all the children have got to see they crawl with the use of their knees and their hands so i wonder is that normal you know I, then one time one weekend i was at home with her then i saw her move i wonder oh my god is this real is it happening and i was like oh, okay i've seen it so it's true then i asked a lot of people they told oh, they have never seen because of most of the children, they move with their knees and their you know, hands. So I was like, ah, when people visit me and they see my child crawling like this, maybe they will wonder she's not okay. Then uh. one time, then, you know, I used to see it as if it's not normal. Until there's this one friend of mine, I just I was just telling him like that. And also he told me, oh, even me, all of my children crawl like that, you know. Now he has three kids, but, but then he had two. So the first one also crawled like that, and the second one. So I was like, oh, so it happens. So it's normal. And I would wonder if she was crawling like that. Would she ever, you know, stand on her own? Because she was crazy, guys. I'm going to insert her picture, you know. And guys, let me just show you this video. Just tell me what you think about it. You're <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
So guys, that's it. So I just decided to accept it and you know I knew that no this is normal but at least she's moving, you know she's not stagnating at you leave her that's why I'm just buying her, you know. At least she's moving. But now <laughs> I just I just got fond of her got fond of her growing style and I accepted it so now when people would come home and see that you know they will be so happy you know I, this is rare it's a scene you know now that will make me see as my child was special you know yeah because I know I used, <laughs> I used to say that she's extraordinary you know yeah and guys this is just to tell you that everyone is born different you know the way you see me and you look at yourself and you compare us you know there's a unique thing about everyone you know maybe stages in life well, yourself yeah so guys so that was my experience as a first time mom you know because now I even thought of taking her to a specialist, you know, but now I was told that it's normal. And now, after some months, now she could stand on her own. And when she was standing one, I tell you, she could move, you know, from one point to another. But not that stable, but she could walk. Yes, guys, so this is my story. I just wanted to share that video with you guys, you know. So on the comment section, tell me what you see, what you like about that video, if whether your child also experienced that with their child. Yeah. So guys, like this video, share, subscribe for more videos. I love you guys. Bye.